Welcome back to the channel. So I'm out here on the banks of the Similkameen River. I'm gonna do a little van camping, spend the night here. I'm currently en route to a Soyuz because it's my dad's 65th birthday today. So we're gonna go have a little barbecue tomorrow night, but I thought I'd get ahead of it. I'm just outside of Manic Park, again on the banks of the Similkameen River. I say banks, it's it's more of just a shore. Anyways, I'm gonna do a van camp tonight. I think it, first thing in the morning, I'm gonna head out, go to Princeton, and then head up to a Soyuz. But anyways, I just pulled up here. It's kind of a busy spot. There's quite a few people over there. Some over there. Some over there. It's a pretty busy spot, but I just pulled up alongside here. Uh, I'm gonna take a quick smoke break. And then I'll probably fire up the barbecue. I'm a little hungry, but uh, yeah, I'll probably have a quick smoke break, fly the drone, barbecue. Yeah, I'll see you later. drone still works I crashed that thing in the water and sank it uh, for at least 10 seconds on my last video so I was very thankful that it still worked my buddy Derek pulled it out of the water that's twice that he saved my drone um, because I, I actually crash it quite often anyways um, I'm gonna unpack here I got my bicycle here in the way because I plan on riding my bike Tomorrow uh, in Princeton is the plan. So tonight I'm gonna be here camping uh, and then I'm gonna take off early in the morning. I want it to be early in the morning, but honestly I have a tendency to sleep in and leave late. So we'll see what happens, but I would like to ride my bike in Princeton. Anyways, I'm gonna unpack, pull up the barbecue, cook some dinner. Tank. Well, that was a real pain. I really need to fix those doors, but I have propane. This thing is beat up. I'm ready to purchase a new barbecue. Or like this one. Ask one, ask for one for Christmas. going on here for dinner. So for dinner I got some limited edition queso pepper and jack cheese sausage. 
They were three dollars off. <laughs> Sorry, they were three dollars off at Freshco, so I couldn't pass up the deal. They expire today and look a little. Anyways, good to go. I got these twice baked potatoes. They came in a four pack. I really don't need four, but I'm by myself. And uh, let's be honest, I'm a little fat, so I'm gonna eat four potatoes, a couple pieces of sausage, and a little THC drink. These things are good. Delicious. I gotta clean up the garbage. I think these potatoes are done. Good to me. It's a pretty good looking meal. Sausage, potatoes, a lot of potatoes. It's pretty delicious to me. Some hooligans coming up over there. Not feel weird about filming with you guys. But, uh, yeah, I'm gonna let this thing cool and then eat. Oh, cheers. Brought paper towel out here, but I'm using my pants. pretty good I feel like you're probably not gonna be able to see this but I can see so many mosquitoes like I kind of doubt you can see them but if you could that'd be dope but uh, there's like a <laughs> so many but I forgot to pack sweatpants today because I packed in a hurry and I really regret that. But I'm gonna uh, put on some long sleeves and bug spray on my legs. And I'm just gonna chill by the propane fire. And other than that, uh, I'll see you in the morning.
Oh, well, good morning. I'm packed up and ready to go, other than my bicycle there. That's all I got to pack up. But honestly, this is a pretty good spot. Like last night, I was just chilling here. And I am, I feel like I'm totally by myself when I'm on this side of the van. Like private beach, totally alone. I don't hear anybody. But then when I actually come around here, this place is. <laughs> this place is actually pretty popular. Yeah, so I actually picked a pretty good spot. But anyways, I'm gonna roll out of here and pack my bike up, roll out of here, head to Princeton, go for a bike ride. Just passed through the Princeton Gateway. I'm officially on my bike ride. It's full suns out, guns out mode. It's, I don't know, I didn't check the temperature, but it's 8.37 a.m. and it's pretty warm. Had a long sleeve on, way too hot. I'll check out this train. <laughs> On the, uh, I guess it's the Trans Canada Trail in Princeton. Headed west. Uh, I think when I was looking up what to do when I was in Princeton, I just happened to notice that the A and W was right next to the river, which happened to have a trail, and it was part of the old Kettle Valley Railway. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I had to take a little dog break. Anyways, I noticed it was on the Trans Canada Trail, which is part of the. This section was part of the Kettle Valley Railway. And I was just looking at Google Maps and I saw there's like an old Kettle Valley Tunnel this direction. So that's where I'm headed now. And then the other side, I'm gonna head back past where I parked. Go back the other way, there's something called the Bridge of Dreams. And uh, those just look like the places I wanted to visit when I was in Princeton. So, anyways, turn this camera around, keep going on this ride. Nineteen sixty one. Not that much to the tunnel. It's just kind of long and dark. Light at the end. But it's kind of neat knowing there's trains that used to come through here.
kind of neat. A little shorter than I anticipated, but uh, I'm gonna go down a little trail here. And I think I'm gonna fly my drone. And then I'm gonna head back and go check out the Bridge of Dreams. Trail. So I do a little quick little double check for bears. I didn't see some bears on trail warning signs. But anyways, I'm gonna fly my drone. Again, headed to the bridge of dreams. <coughs> Morning. Tough guys in the park today. No one stop signs. On the train again. Kettle Valley Rail Trail. So actually this is kind of interesting. Last Last weekend, two weeks ago, I camped on the Kettle Valley Railway somewhere between Beaverdale and Rock Creek, by right here where it's the R and the G R for Greenwood, but I think that's Greenwood. But yeah, you can go, on the Kettle Valley, you can go from Hope all the way, like starting at Othello Tunnels, all the way through Meyer Canyon up by Kelowna, in Kelowna, all the way to Castlegar. And the one guy I seen on the, I saw one random dude on the bike uh, on the Kettle Valley where I was camping, outside of Rock Creek there. He was and aiming for Nelson was his plan, all the way from, I forget where he started, but he was aiming for Nelson. So, it's Kettle Valley Railway, trans Trail. It is pretty impressive, actually, and it's cool. I would like to ride it. I can't tell if this thing is art or a climbing thing. Hey. 
anyways. What a cool van. Here's some more information about the Kettle Valley Trail. I'm not gonna read this. Here, Bridge of Dreams Reconstruction. Got a cool little observation deck here. This is the Bridge of Dreams. How are we looking? short little bike ride i'm gonna finish up here go back to AW, but that's it it's the end of this episode riverside camping on the similkameen princeton bike ride hashtag van life <laughs>